Excitement in the kitchen. Say, let's see the excitement. All right. Just you come along with me and I'll show it to you. Welcome, folks. I'm Jonathan, the appliance dude here at Curto's in Westchester County. Welcome to my appliance sanctuary here high atop Central Avenue in beautiful and bucolic Yonkers, New York. I am here today to start a multi-part video series on what I believe is and what I know is one of the, the best, if not the best, professional ranges in the marketplace right now, the Capital Connoisseurian Dual Fuel Range which I proudly sit in front of right now in lotus position in this beautiful, beautiful race car red finish. Race car red, high performance for a high performance range. Um, so much to discuss with this range. We're gonna, as I said, segment this out into multiple videos. Um, the Connoisseurian line follows the Culinarian line, which was the open burner product that Capital rolled out a number of years ago. I'm going to shift the initial narrative away from burners and BTU output because I'm incredibly bored by that. Okay, um, that's a story and narrative that has you know been talked about, and you go into appliance stores, and that's usually what these guys go right to. Well, it's 23,000, it's 25,000 BTUs. I'm not really interested in that story because when it all boils down to it, no pun intended, you're really using the maximum amount of BTUs for a very, very, very limited amount of time in the amount of time you actually cook. You're bringing things up to boil, okay, maybe you're doing wok, whatever, but for the most part, the high, high output of the BTUs is really not the story and what you shouldn't be focused on. It's more about control. It's about simmering. It's about other things, and we're going to take it away from the top of the stove. The conversation moves away from there. We're taking it into the oven because this oven is incomparable. It has so much going on here that, quite honestly, it's amazing what you're getting for $62.99. That's right, that is the price as I speak today. I believe there is a price increase coming up, but for a 36 inch dual fuel range at $62.99, that's several thousand, plural, several thousand dollars less than other high-end dual fuel ranges. The thing that people talk about the most when it comes to the oven here, I mean their capacity, their capacity is huge. I believe it's 4.4 usable. Um, they rated 4.6, but who gives a rat's ass about that because it's all about the usable capacity. It's 4.4. The broiler inside here, if they're using the glass infrared broiler, okay? The, the glass broiler, again, you want that steakhouse sear. This is what you have to use. There's only two companies in the marketplace right now who are using glass broilers. That's Capital, which they do in the dual fuel, and they do it in the wall ovens, and they do it in the gas self clean ranges, okay? Also, Viking does it in their wall ovens. And I believe Viking also, actually, do they do it in their dual fuel ranges? I'd have to check on that, but they definitely do it in the wall ovens. The glass and fur broiler, the glass broiler, electric ribbons inside it on this, so much better, precise searing, gets the temperature immediately. It actually is a variable control in there as well. And you will get the steakhouse quality sear that you may be looking for in your broiler, okay? That's the thing. People don't talk about broilers. It's all about ah, well, how, how you know, the high, high BTU output. How, I don't want to talk about that. There's other things to discuss. We're bringing the story back to the oven. So right off the bat, the broiler completely kicks ass. What about the moist assist feature? This is something which they introduced in their wall ovens. Basically, you have an electric oven in here with the moist assist. You're then getting the advantages of a gas oven because what the moist assist does, and it's not done via steam. You fill this little canister up, which you probably see on the screen right now, now with water and what it does is it creates an atmosphere within the oven that basically mimics a gas oven it's moister you will get incredible results in your roasts and an electric oven and that's really not what an electric oven is about an electric oven is really about precise even heat very good for baking but for those who like their meats who like to roast like their bird it's always been about a gas oven, but you can do that. So this, this range basically is wearing two different hats. That's what I'm trying to tell you right here. The moist assist feature, which is patented or it's patent pending, is completely insane. I've used it. Nuts. We've sold so many of these. Not so much of the Connoisseurian ranges. That's catching on now, but for the wall oven, 
That's one of the main selling features of the Capital Wall Oven. What else does it have? The Moto Rotis, okay? Yes, it has the rotisserie. I don't know if it's set up. Well, there it is. I don't know if you could see that, but um, the rotisserie, the meat probe, and the rotisserie, it's not one of these bullshit rotisseries that you find like on like, you know, the Weber barbecue or some of the low end to medium barbecues. I mean, this is, a, this is a rotisserie that you could fit a heavy load of meat on there, okay? Now what I'm gonna do is disclose to you one of the most important features about this range, which is nobody else in the business offers this feature, and I guarantee you this is something that is not gonna be mentioned to you when you go to an appliance dealership and you're thinking about buying this range or any other high-end range, okay? What Capital did, Ingenious, they decided to change the floor of the dual fuel range. It is no longer porcelain. It is now, there's now, there's now a, glass, um, a glass top on it, a glass tempered top on the bottom of the floor. And the first thing you're gonna ask, of course, is, that's like, how, you know, is that safe, can it break? We'll get into that later. Um, what this glass floor does is it ab it's gonna basically extend the life of your range. Let me explain to you why. Let's go into this knowing that there are two baking elements, there are two heating elements underneath that floor, two cal rods, okay? Now, what the glass floor does, glass can actually withstand a higher temperature output from these two concealed bake elements because glass can handle temperatures in excess of 2,000 degrees. Now, the cal rod, knowing that, so the glass can handle up to 2,000 degrees, okay? The cal rods the, that are concealed underneath here get 1,700, 1,800 degrees, so they can definitely get up there. Um, now, what we need to know is, and now we're going back to science class here in high school, is that Around 1600 degrees, alloys and metals, okay, porcelain included here, they begin to separate and they begin to potentially pop and disfigure, wrap, crack, okay? So what they've done is, because they know how high the temperature gets in here, they're saying to themselves, hey listen, forget about the porcelain, the cow rods get too hot, we're gonna go coat it with glass on the bottom, and that is gonna prevent the wrapping and the cracking and whatever else may happen when the alloys get too hot. Now, I don't mean to be throwing all the science at you, but cooking is a science, you need to understand this, because you're making a heavy investment over here. So that's part one of the video series on the Capital Dual Fuel Range. Um, the oven, it's incredible. There's nothing else in the business like it right now. So I would wrap my arms around it. And if you have any questions, of course, we have uh, everybody in here is a capital expert. Call, email, come in, please come in. We're centrally located to everybody in Connecticut and Jersey. It's all good. I just had a couple come in today. Drove two hours from Southern New Jersey to come in, check out capital equipment and bought. And they love the appliance, dude. And that's what it's all about, folks. It's about helping all you out there, getting through the noise, the dissonance that's out there in the appliance world, whether it's on a sales floor or whether it's on the internet where there's so much noise out there. You come to the appliance, dude. You come to my people. We deliver the goods with honesty, with integrity, and with respect for you and the investment that you're making. Cool.